Inson IQ is the Pensbury School District work order system for technology devices and programs. Incident IQ can be accessed by typing pensbury.incidentiq.com into your Chrome browser. Incident IQ uses a single sign on login when the Pensbury account. If prompted, click single sign on with Google. Once your dashboard loads, in order to submit a ticket, expand tickets and click on new ticket. The Create Ticket window will appear and it allows you to select the type of repair you need assistance with. The choices are devices hardware, software online systems, network Wi-Fi, user accounts, or other requests. So click on the icon that best describes your needs and enter the details about your request. Uh, I'm going to put an example of a laptop issue. So I'm going to click on devices hardware. And it's going to prompt me a uh, which asset is this related to. I can either type in the Pensbury tag number or the serial number for the product. Or if the device is one that's assigned to me, my asset should be displayed. And I'm just going to click on my Lenovo laptop. Additional categories will open to kind of narrow down the issue with your device. So whether or not it is for connectivity reasons, the display, you're having a power issue, the keyboard, trackpad, or mouse is not working right. Um, you can select whichever one of those options. I'm going to click on display. So from here, it's prompting me one more time to be a little more specific with what the issue is with my device. So for this, I'm going to put in my screen monitor does not turn on. Uh, some of the other options are that the screen is cracked or broken or my touch screen is not working. And in almost every instance, there's the ability to select the issues not listed and put in a more uh, generic uh, explanation of what's happening with your laptop or device. So I'm going to get a text box that asks me to describe my issue. So you want to add as many details as possible so the technician will have a, a better idea of how to help uh, resolve the issue with your device. So I'm just going to put in um, the laptop screen is dim and will not um, brighten when I use the bright dim uh, buttons on the keyboard. So there I've described my issue. And now what I need to do is uh, put down where my device is going to be and how my technician can find me. So depending on the school that you're assigned to, so I need to tell my technician where they can find me. So out in the buildings, it will most likely have uh, the list of room numbers, whether it's the or the office, uh, some different information. But since I'm in central office, basically the uh, information I would select technology office or let's just say, for instance, I am somebody that is not necessarily in the building all the time or my location for some reason is not listed. So I'm going to check on this one. Just my room is not listed and then I could provide additional location details. And uh, I'm just going to put here, um, I'm in the building on Tuesday and Thursday. That way my technician knows that to kind of arrange when to come out to see me at that time. You also have the ability to attach some files. So let's say I, um, my screen was broken or even with the picture of the dim screen, if I took a, a picture of my laptop and I wanted to upload it, I can browse and select that file. Once all the information's in, I'm going to hit submit my ticket. Once your ticket has been submitted, you will receive an email from Incident IQ letting you know the status of that ticket. And on your dashboard, you may see notifications regarding your ticket.